Hello, we, we are on week, is it 23 or 24? I'll label it. <laughs> I hardly remember anymore. All I know is that I feel big. I feel big, bigger all the time. I'm a little bit more awkward and I certainly tend to frequently have watermarks across my belly when I do dishes or make food or whatever. There's little stains that creep across here so I'm always watching, washing my clothes. I took some notes to make sure I just touched a couple of things really quick. Don't want this to go on too long. I am getting more heartburn. Oh, I do not like heartburn. It's like my ribs are out. I feel it right here. It's just this burning kind of pressure. Man, I had it last night. I thought maybe I pulled a muscle, but it wasn't. It took stretching and and I just, I had to get my arm in just a certain position, hugging my big pillow and and I fell asleep thankfully after a big old burp that helped <laughs> but uh, the heartburn ugh. so when I have heartburn I realize I am not well hydrated and I've got to drink more more liquid I drink lemon water like about a, a full two uh, two quarts of lemon water every day a whole lemon fresh lemon I drink prune juice I drink um, Pero with chocolate milk um, and then water. So liquid, 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 which of course then gets me in the restroom a whole bunch. And um, all right, I talked about in my, um, my, my, my belly band video. If you haven't seen it, you've got to watch it. Anyway, on my belly band video, I talked about the tupler technique where you suck in your gut. I am going to do a video on exercises. You wouldn't even know I'm exercising right now, but I am exercises to take care of the belly split because my belly split definitely is there and and I definitely need to exercise. I know because I get sore doing oh, what should be simple things. I wake up at 4 a.m. I don't know if you're doing this, but I wake up at 4 a.m. She starts kicking here and here and poking and kind of tickly and it's kind of this funny little feeling. Sometimes it hurts but most of the time it's really quite fun but it wakes me up at four o'clock in the morning and sometimes I just don't go back to sleep. So in the afternoon I take an hour or two nap if I'm lucky. If not I fall crash asleep at oh, 8 30 9 o'clock. Oh weight gain. All right first trimester I lost 10 to 15 pounds. I was hoping, may I might actually be on track. Anyway, I'm about 155 now. At week 23, that actually is not too bad. So thumbs up. I'm doing really quite good. My face isn't all big and poofy, though I'm certainly gaining weight around my legs and my belly. I have extra fat. I can tell it's not this tight. Well, it can't be tight after three other children and me not taking care of that whole diastasis erecti, but anyway. So I'm gaining weight here around my bum, and um, but not too bad. So, you know, 55, 35, 20 pounds, and week 23, not bad at all. They say about a pound a week, anywhere between 25 and 35 pounds, you're probably in a good range. So. I'm right on track. I'm excited about that. The other babies, that wasn't exactly the case. Oh, I cannot take prenatal vitamins. Most of them. I haven't been able to find the one that works for me. The prenatal vitamins that I have taken throws me into a 30-day depression that I don't know I'm in until I'm out of the vitamin and and I don't have, you know, I was like, oh, I've got to go to the store and it's a day or two and I'm like, suddenly my mood is lifting. There's something in the vitamins that just is not happy. Yeah, my body is just not happy with. So I'm not taking prenatal vitamins, but what I am taking is Dr. Schultz Superfood. I did that with all of my children. Well, they had prenatals too, but, and it's really, really good. I've got it on my website. Go to my website, take a look at it. I highly recommend it. I love his products. Um, I love his products. He's very good. His his audios are hilarious if you have health issues on a normal basis, not just, you know, the, the ones that attend pregnancy. Um, but he, he's a, a funny dude, the Dr. Schultz dude is. And the superfood, I swear by it. I love it. I drink it in my prune juice twice a day. That's my vitamin. 
and it's working very well. In fact, I went to the midwife just a short time ago, and and she did a um, you know a blood test. Uh, what was she checking for? I don't even remember what she was checking for. Probably iron and so on and so forth. Anyway, so she pricked my finger and we're trying to get the blood out and it's clotting so fast. Her question is, so are you, are you must be doing a ton of greens. I'm like, well, actually, if I get a salad in a day, I'm doing tons of turkey sandwiches and lots of bran cereal. But if I get a salad in a day, I'm doing really good. Though I am doing the superfood. I'm like, wow, if that's making that huge of a difference, that's pretty big. So I think those are my notes for this week. So there's my belly. I do have my belly band on. It's under my clothes, so I'm not going to show it to you right now. You have to watch my other video on that. Um, it certainly is more comfortable. Before wearing the belly band, I'd run around wear it, holding my belly like this, going up and down the stairs. Oh, oh, I don't have to do that anymore. It fits right here. It comes up like this all around my back. My back is supported. I can tighten it. I can loosen it. The my whole belly has just gone gone a little more narrow and more up, which is really good. It'll make birth so much easier. Like I said in the other video, I was a flat basketball beforehand. Not a fun thing. It was really oh, heavy and down here, and my pelvic was hurting, and and right here in the hips. I didn't say that in the other one, but it was all hurting down in here, and my bones. I don't have that anymore. I'm so relieved. So if you're this far along, um, belly band, I recommend it. Dr. Schultz Superfood, I recommend it. A body pillow, a, a preggy pillow type thing, I recommend it. Watch my other video. Go to my website. I found them for you. They're on there. They're in my store. Go for it.